Right, welcome back to another episode of Suicide Max Tinker Hole. And what we're going to do right here is get this fired up and we're going to see what the sound level is like outside the rest of it. And then we're going to go plug this in inside. Now that is locked up. There's the light on inside with that already going. Here we go. Here's the other one that's going to be going in there. And <clears throat> so there's the back side of the hole there. So you can see everything that's in there. I'm not sure if you can see what I've got going in here, but... Right. And then I've got the plug right there. And you should be able to hear it here in this moment. Now that is outside right there. Biggest thing we're looking for is noise reduction. So here's a baseline, and then we'll do it again after we insulate the entire structure. Guess what we're doing? We got some insulation today. I got. Hopefully enough. If not, we'll live. Um, and because it's a glorious day out here, I'm gonna make it, you know, absolutely horrible on myself and do this without long sleeps because I'm a masochist. Nice. Okay, so here I'm working on trying to get the insulation in on this, and it's about three days later, and after finishing up with doing this shed and everything else that I did that night, I feel like I smoked an entire pack of smokes within one night. Ow. Um, I recommend wearing proper PPE, uh, including long sleeves, mask, goggles, all that good stuff. Don't do as I do. Well, I mean, God, just doing the doors already. <laughs> just sitting right in between them. It's like, whoa. Mm -hmm. Cotton candy. Remember kids, don't eat the cotton candy in the attic. I'm out of staples.
around here right now, but it smells amazing. Cutting into a whole bat here just for one 26 inch piece. One 26 inch piece. Okay, and so I'm gonna get these all sealed up here for us. Uh, all the, the gaps back behind all of that. Same thing right over here on this side. And yeah, so I wanna take care of stuff like that so that we don't have a bug problem. And we're gonna use some of this stuff. And I hope it works. A little too much there. Sweet. I got a couple of cans of this, but I think the one should do it. I don't think this stuff expands very much. It doesn't, at least it doesn't look like it is. So. I know my camera work on this has got to be lovely. I'm trying to see and focus. And keep that door open. Get some of you in there. Hopefully. Now, how come it's the second side here that I'm not able to keep as pretty as the first? I'm sure that somebody's that's used this stuff a lot more than I have is yelling at me for being so so disgustingly messy with this. Get that over here, still. Now I'm just trying to waste the rest of the can so I don't have it laying around forever. Oh, oh, there's a spot there. Cool. Let's just get this one up here, too. Oh, yep, as I can see, there's some light up there. All right, down there, okay. So we'll get that.
Gosh, it looks like we are good up there. Okay, who's on my phone? Woo! I think we did it. Now I'm just trying to pull the wire out and through, and I think I'm kicked up.
really needed to clean this. Is in. It's all wired. Here it goes up. It goes over and down and around and over and down and over to there. And it goes up and through and this way through the conduit, which was a pain in the ass getting through this, this corner here. That sucked. It kept binding up. What's even better though now, look at that guys. We have our own air compressor circuit. So, shall we? Uh-oh, I don't, I don't hear anything yet. Oh wait, I put a switch inside. You can almost not hear them. Let's go make sure they're both working. That is much, much quieter. I am very happy with it. We've been rather productive today. So happy. As you can manage, imagine, I've made a mess here in the shop. Moving stuff out of the way, getting everything all put into place and up and around. So it it's this time. And now we clean up. 